So today I thought I would give you an intro to all of my critters. So this is Pickles. His name is Pickles because <clears throat> Succulentaurus is like enrichment, which is why he's got different textures in here. And so I asked my son to bring me a, to a toy to bring in here. So if he wanted to push it around, he could. And he brings Crusher. And Crusher's best friend on Blaze Monster Machine is Pickles. So this little guy's name is Pickles. But yes, and he is spoiled rotten already. He has this huge 40 gallon trough. Yep. And I even went and bought a collard green plant. And he gets fresh collards. He's got a little water dish. You need to get him a bigger room, but that's fine. Got him some little pebbles for different texture and different things to crawl on. And then we have him some succulent. I don't know exactly the name of it, but it's for Oops. it is for his specific tortoise species. Well, and a few others as well, but yeah, so like he's already rotten and I love it. Like my husband even rigged that up for me so he can stay warm. And yes, this I made this. Isn't it cute? Yeah, I well I put the embroidery. Actually I made the whole thing. This was just a piece of cloth and I did I sewed this on and I embroidered this. So yeah. Isn't it cute? Anyways, this is where he likes to go and cuddle up at night because apparently he's bougie and I'm all for it. Okay, so enough about pickles. Let's move on. The next is my curly hair tarantula male Lulo. And you are just not going to see him because he is in pre-molt again. His last molt he was confirmed mature male. And well, now he's just in here in his little hidey spot. This is our newest addition. Um, I will try to see if I can get the lid off, but like, look how freaky. This is an Arizona Blondie. I can not pronounce the scientific name because just that's not part of me. Anyways, so this is this little cutie. Super excited. His butt is getting dark and patchy, so I'm thinking this one's in pre molt but yes. And then I have a third tarantula, which this is the best of you I can give you. This is my pink salmon bird eater. So he's going to be massive, and I'm loving it. He was itty bitty when I got him, and he is an old. He was my biggest trench. Well, my second biggest. I had other ones, but yeah. Anyways, <clears throat> so he's huge. You just can't tell because he's all scrunched up. And where is this little one at? I have a jumping spider in here. Okay, here he is. This is chicken wing. Chicken wing is right here. Not sure gender, but it is a cute little bold jumping spider. And then we're going to move over to our other bold jumping spider, which you're not going to get a good view of because he's made his hammock. I also don't know the gender of this one. And this one is cheeseburger um, in his little bedroom. And we don't mess with them when they're in their rooms. And yeah. And then this beauty which you can't really see is Cookie. She's my new addition out of the jumping spiders. She came with this guy and I got them from Sunday Spiders. So you can go look them up or you can send them an email sundayspiders at gmail.com if you're interested because their babies are amazing and definitely affordable. This is Cookie, not Cookie, I'm sorry, Coffee. Coffee. <laughs> That's how I remember their names. I decided to 
Because, like, you know, the little food minis, I think they're cute. So, I was like, instead of name tags, let's sit here and put this. And this is french fry. So these are ribs, but there's, like, little french fries in them. Yeah, so this is french fry. This is coffee. She is in her bedroom. And this is cupcake. Cupcake is also in her room. And she is, looks like she is webbing it up. It's really funny <clears throat> because the day after I got him, he kept putting him in here. He made, the first day, he made his bedroom right there. Sorry, my kid's in the background. And then he noticed the next day, he noticed coffee, which, uh, I'm not moving anybody's bedroom for this. Sorry, guys. But anyways, so coffee, he noticed her and he started dancing. He is still too little. He needs like another two molts. Two or three molts. And she is way too young. Like, she still needs a lot more molts before that's even a possibility. Which, I don't even know if that's a route I want to go yet. But anyways. It's like, she didn't come out, but she was watching him. And this beauty, whenever, as soon as I put her in here, she started her bedroom. And then kind of just, like, chilled in it. Didn't really come out for much, just to eat, and then she'd go back in. But when I got him, and he was over here... She came out and would watch. She'd climb on her little ladder right here and she would just watch him. And then eventually he came to his spot and then she'd go closer to where he was and she'd watch him. He hasn't danced for her. So, but yeah, I just thought that was really funny. On um, my TikTok, I'm doing like a little mini series of who will he choose, which obviously if you're a part of the spider community, you know it's the female's choice, not the male's. They're kind of like, most people the man will get what they can take and yeah but anyways back to these guys so yes these are my babies and i am extremely ecstatic and these are tarantula cribs i got them and i am obsessed i love them so much like i got these two obviously the zellas because they're cheaper but the price different like if you see the size like in the long run, like these are, these are it, you know, because these are smaller. This one will definitely need an upgrade. This is pretty much the permanent, the medium tree house. And they're like pretty much the end goal for their houses. So they will definitely, when they get their upgrade, they will be going to this. And when these guys get their upgrade, they'll be going to this, these, so yes and all the cute little decorations you see on the inside i also made because i'm a stay-at-home mama with a sewing business and i have time well sometimes it depends on my children but yeah these are my babies and i'm also at the moment oh he's going in his little hide that's a hide because you can't see so i'll have to get them bigger for him um I'm also fostering a kitten at the moment until we can get him, until he's eight weeks and we can get him into a permanent home. But yeah, this is my life and I'm loving it.